Welcome to Open Office Video. I am Martin, and in this video, I will show you how to uh, format text boxes. Because when you insert a default text box, I will show you. I will do the insert frame method. Here you have it. Well, let's just drag it here. Let's make it a little bit bigger. And let's put some text in. Oh, sorry. You just click once and you just type in some text. Now what you see is the distance here between the text box and the text surrounding it is um, well basically zero. And the same happens with the text in the text box. It's right up to the edges. And if we make give it a color, well let's make it red. Then this can can become pretty ugly and annoying. First we'll uh, adjust, we make the text inside the text box, uh, give it a bit more distance from the border. We go to format and we go to paragraph since it, this is basically just a paragraph inside the, inside the text box. And you have a number of options here, you have borders, you have drop gaps, but what we're looking at alignment, you can say, well, let's do it centered, it's always nice in a text box, I think. But that wasn't the option, sorry, paragraph. Uh, I was looking for it's actually the indent and the spacing as well. The indent is you can see in the example here gives a sort of preview of what's going to happen. You move it from the left border that's obviously what we want and you also want to keep it from the right border. This obviously doesn't show at this point but that's I'm, I'm exaggerating a bit and sometimes well you want the first line to go a bit more. You see what it does here, this means that this only applies to the first line. And we also want to adjust the spacing. We want to do it above and it automatically does it below the paragraph. Now what you'll see, since I exaggerated a bit, this is what happens because of the first, first line. But it keeps a distance here and it keeps a distance there and it keeps a neat distance on top. So that's for the inside and now we want to make sure that the normal body text keeps distance from our text box. First we left click it to select it and then we right click on one of these dots so we see I had the hand, let me show that again, the hand symbol up here and then we right click and we go to frame and here we have the wrap option. Here you can say, okay, I only want text onto the left of my text book or to the right. Uh, but we'll just stick with parallel. And we can also, here we have the spacing option as well. Well, don't exaggerate with this one because it's going to take a lot of space. And a little bit will show, will already look, uh, look good. And here it keeps its distance. You see, this is already a bit much. Let's just make this half of this. I'm just going to type it in here. You can also of course vary. You can make it left bigger than right or whatever, but usually it's best to keep it separate. And here you see it's closer. Now you see the, this distance is a bit bigger but that becomes that's because you can only uh, of course have a whole line or uh, nothing. So if you want to do a proper formatting, and just drag this up a little bit and see how it see how it fits. All right, that's um, formatting text boxes and text. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. And you can, if you want to receive more videos in the future. Uh, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye!